Commodity trader Noble Group has been slapped with a $12.6 million civil penalty for publishing misleading information in its financial statements. Now, this is the largest fine of its kind in Singapore's history, and it caps a joint probe that began in November 2018 by the Monetary Authority of Singapore, the Accounting and Corporate Regulatory Authority, and the Commercial Affairs Department. Well, the agency said that investigations had revealed that Noble Group and its then-subsidiary Noble Resources International applied an incorrect accounting treatment to marketing agreements with mine owners and coal producers, classifying these as financial instruments instead of service contracts. This inflated their reported profits and net assets and was in breach of the Securities and Futures Act. OMS has said the penalty demonstrates the serious view it takes on breaches of disclosure obligations. I think the MAS is very vigilant and determined to safeguard the integrity of our market. So I think the impact uh, on the price of the securities, the losses, if any, suffered by minority investors, I think these are factors that we've taken into account before deciding on the appropriate uh, penalty or enforcement actions to be taken. Uh, so I think the MAS is uh, signaling that, um, you know, you can't get away with any misleading statements Noble Group was once Asia's largest commodity trader. Facing insolvency in 2018, it was forced to restructure Noble Resources Trading Holdings, a group that emerged after the restructuring, said it welcomed the conclusion of the probe. It added it has been under new ownership and management from 2018 and has focused on the highest standards of corporate governance, reporting and transparency since.